Hello everyone and welcome or welcome back to our channel. This week we are heading west through Washington. Right now we're passing the Pioneer Fire which is burning over 35,000 acres currently. And we're really heading west because we want to escape the smoke that is plaguing most of the west right now. We are traveling on Highway 20, the Cascade Highway, and this road goes through North Cascades National Park. It's a very beautiful drive which goes up and over a glacial valley and you can just see these really pointy mountains and the green valley below and it is just stunning. The highest point of the road is Washington Pass and it is a whopping 5,744 feet tall. There's a short hike off of the pass and you get to see these beautiful views close up. This is Liberty Bell Mountain, which sits at an elevation of 7,720 feet. There are 18 established climbing routes on Liberty Bell. I can't even imagine climbing up this really steep mountain. Wildfire smoke was starting to move into the area, but luckily we got to see the viewpoint before it got too bad. There are actually over 300 glaciers in North Cascades Park Complex, which is more than any other park in the lower 48. And something that's unique about North Cascades is there's actually no entrance fee to the park. We were just quickly driving through the park but still got to see some very beautiful sights just from the road, which was great. We stopped to make lunch at this pull-off and down below you can start to see the Skagit River, which has a series of dams on it and the dams actually provide electricity for Seattle. We stopped to see the Gorge Creek Falls, which is flowing down into the Gorge Lake. We stopped to buy the visitor center and did the short trail behind to see this beautiful view of a glacier. Now on to day two of our North Cascades adventure. Starting out with these beautiful foxglove flowers that were along the trail. We are heading up on Boulder Ridge Trail, which is going to give us a beautiful viewpoint of Mount Baker. We went past this nice little waterfall where I think fairies would hang out. The trail took us for two miles through the forest before coming to this open valley area. We got a sneak peek of Baker from this valley, but we wanted to keep on pushing up the trail to get a better view of the mountain. And this is when we really start climbing up the mountain. This trail has an elevation gain of over 2,000 feet, and we were feeling it. But we were rewarded with a beautiful view of Baker and the surrounding areas. Down there you can see Baker Lake and this was just breathtaking. It was a stunning view and there was so much snow on the mountain. We were in shock at how much snow. You can see there's a small waterfall where all the melting snow is going off, but there are some really intense glaciers on Baker and we did not want to attempt to climb it without the correct equipment, but that definitely is a bucket list thing for us now. I would love to be able to climb up mountains like that. We did not want to leave the beautiful Mount Baker wilderness, but we ended up leaving. And where we're headed next is the Olympic Peninsula. So make sure to subscribe, like this video, and leave a comment down below. And stay tuned for our next video coming soon.